So Christmas has just passed and the next thing that usually is on our minds is the new year. And then we begin to think about New Year's resolutions. What um, would we like to see change in our lives? And oftentimes weight loss is a part of that or getting stronger or being more fit. Or who knows, new business goals, new relationship goals, new family uh, new things we'd like to see happen in our families. And it's, I think it's really interesting that in all of my years as a coach, I oftentimes see people start and fail at New Year's resolutions. And I think it's because the philosophy of New Year's resolutions is all wrong, or at least whatever the expectations we have or we hold culturally about New Year's resolutions is not very accurate. We think that come January, whether that be precisely on the first or some days after, that there's something we should have in mind that we would like to stick to. And it just doesn't work for the majority of people. So here's what I would suggest. I, I would suggest that you think about it differently. And that you begin to understand that the new year is not about a resolution. The new year is about a new you. The new year is not about a resolution. It's not about a new goal or acquiring something new. It's about a new you, because whatever it is that you think you would like to experience, you know, a new experience, the reason you haven't experienced it so far is because you are expecting the old you to do something new. And that's not how it works at all. The old you cannot experience something new. The old you cannot step out of its own perspective or its own worldview, its own psychological box and create new experiences. But that's what the New Year's res resolution is supposed to be. It's supposed to be the creation and experience of something new. You cannot create that new thing if you yourself are the same person perspective must change. Your mindset must change. The concept of yourself must be renewed. You must awaken to new possibilities in order to have the new experience that you would like to have. So then what's really important? Is it the experience you'd like to have or is it the new you that enables that new experience to be reality? Of course, the answer is the important thing is the new version of you. The new version of you can do anything. So if you put the new thing before the new you, you will never accomplish it. If you put the resolution and the new year before the new you, you will never reach the goal. So as a life coach, as a life and love coach, I'm here to tell you that it's about the new you perspective, a new mindset. Old beliefs and old patterns and old cycles must be left behind if you would like to see your life be changed. And this puts all of the responsibilities square in your lap where it's actually, it's actually always been square in your lap, but you've been so busy looking outward and blaming others that you don't see that <laughs> all of the outward looking and all the blaming is still the old you who will not reach the new goals, who cannot perform the new resolution. So you must change. And that change is going to require courage. It's going to require that you find a new strength. It's going to re require that you find a new knowledge. 
a new language, a new wisdom. It's going to require an upgrade on your part. And the sky is the limit. You can go as far as you want, but the further you'd like to go, the more renewed and awakened you must become. Your scope, your point of reference must must become broader and deeper. The new year is about the new you. And I can help you with that. I've been a life coach and a fitness coach for many, many years. I'm an author, a recording artist, a public speaker. I have made it my life's work to understand the human psyche and why humans think the way they do, work the way they do, how they can change their lives, how you and I can make a difference in our families, in our communities, in our workplace, how we can live the life that we are truly happy living, how we can live the life that truly brings satisfaction and fulfillment to us so that when our days are done, we truly have something to be proud of which has nothing to do with the things we have acquired, but the person we have become. How many times we transformed ourselves into something better and something new, which also allowed our life to become something better and something new. And that inspires people around us because they can see the difference. They can see the change. And you know what? Maybe they can't see the difference and the change, but they still know that there's something amazingly unique and special and encouraging and even enlightening about being around a person who has transformed and been renewed. So here's to a true New Year's resolution, which is all about the new you. That is what this is all about. Email me at thbtv at protonmail.com you're interested in having a free session on creating a proper New Year's resolution.